can you do with a rebozo? ¿Qué puedes hacer con un rebozo? Written by Carmen Tafoya and illustrated by Amy Cordova. What can you do with a rebozo? Mama spreads it like a butterfly to pretty up her dress for Sunday morning or wraps it in a cozy cradle for baby brother so her friends are free to weave a braid for me. Baby brother ducks under a rebozo to play hide and seek and do a peekaboo peek. Big sister twirls a rebozo round and round and ropes it through her shiny hair. Grandma uses hers to keep the cold away on winter nights. It's nice and warm in there. Yesterday, Theo wiped up a spill with Mama's blue rebozo and I helped too. It was full of sticky red ketchup spots but daddy washed it clean as new. On my birthday, we swung a piñata up into the tree and wound the rebozo over our eyes. When we burst that big ball of treats, out came a yummy surprise. You can turn it into a secret tunnel if you have two chairs or a sash for a pirate at sea or even a flying cape, and the superhero is me. When my puppy didn't feel good, I made him a bandage, all nicely tied. And when my cousins turned my room into a playground, it became a long red slide. But what I like to do most with the Revoso is dance. La Bamba, my favorite dance. I dance and dance and dance with my rebozo. I swirl and I leap until I'm so tired that I fall fast asleep on mama's bed where she covers me. Oh, so gently with her rebozo. Okay, kindergarten, so your activity for today is you are going to do a writing activity and the sentence is, this is not a rebozo, it is a blank. So you're going to fill in the blank and you're going to tell me what you can use a rebozo for. And I am going to show you in a bit my writing. Okay, so here is my writing activity that I did and it says, this is not a rebozo, it is a cloth to clean spills. So on my illustration, I drew myself with a rebozo in my hand and I'm cleaning up some spilling that I made. Maybe it's water, or it can be juice. So you're going to come up with your own idea of what else you can use a rebozo for. And it can be something that you read in the book or something else that you came up with. Remember yesterday we were using our imaginations and we played this is not a. So you can be as creative as you want. Just make sure that you are going to write. You're going to finish the sentence. I helped you write the beginning of the sentence and you're going to write an Ill draw an illustration that matches your sentence. You're going to take a picture of it and you're going to upload it onto Seesaw. Adios. One more thing, if you are at home and you cannot print the writing printout, go ahead and write it in your journal. Please do not do it on the iPad. Thank you.